Oh, hi, I'm Kendall. Welcome to my greenhouse. I'm here to talk about gardening and introduce myself. And I really just want to talk about plants, but if I'm going to have a YouTube channel, I have to talk about me. So please comment below if you have a question, something you'd like to know about me. I will try to tell you a few things in this video and try to keep it pretty short. I'm going to be grooming this plant while I talk because I tried to make these videos by myself and they were weird. So I need something to do. I bought this plant for 90% off at a local hardware store. It has the red line 90% off section. Um, and it's a perennial. So it's gonna come back. You can see that it's already coming back. And so I'm just gonna prune off the dead. This is a sticky fly trap thingy. There's one over there too for catching fungus gnats in case I brought a plant home from the hardware store that had fungus gnats. I don't want a bunch in my greenhouse. So that's a lot about plants and not a lot about me. Who am I? I live in Tacoma, Washington with my husband and my 10 year old son and our French bulldog, Luke. I will put a picture of Luke here. I tried to have him do this video with me, but he is so noisy and snorting. It was really distracting. So I put Luke in the house. Luke tries to be helpful, but mostly he's just in the way, but he's cute, so I'll allow it. Anyways, I've been learning how to garden for the last three years or so. A lot of what I've learned is from YouTube, but I did join the Master Gardeners program here in Pierce County. And I've been doing that for about a month as of February, 2024. And I don't know, I kind of feel like maybe I have something to say or share. I was a little scared to start this channel when it was just me learning things from YouTube and trying them in my yard, but I'm kind of, what, more official now that I'm in the Master Gardener program. So I'd like to share what I'm learning with you and share what I'm doing in my yard because I think that's so important just to like look at real examples of what people's yards look like and not just um, professional yards or finished products, right? Like what are people doing along the way to get these beautiful gardens? Um, and I'm learning how to do that. Might as well show you what I've been doing and learning. And if you know more than I do, please comment and <laughs> tell me what I'm doing wrong. Oh boy, there might be a lot, but it's okay to be vulnerable and try things and take a risk, right? Being on YouTube is a risk, but um, I've been thinking about it a while and it's time, it's time to go. It's time to try it. That's what I'm doing. I'm gonna go get the other one of these. I'll be right back. So what do you wanna know about me? I have a background in education. I used to teach at the University of Washington in Seattle, learning sciences, but I'm not doing that right now. Maybe I'll do that later. Right now I'm gardening, I'm setting up a garden. We just moved into this home in Tacoma. I just did a bunch of landscaping stuff. I have a lot of blank space to fill with plants. So I just keep buying them and I want to put them in the ground. I have a ton of bulbs because I thought I was going to have access to my garden earlier than I did and I thought I could put them in and anyways I put some of them in. I will show you videos of that. I just want to talk about plants. I don't want to talk about myself. What do you want to know? Oh, okay, what am I going to talk about on this channel? So I don't know because I just started. What I've been videoing so far are like little projects. I've been potting up little planters like this. These are some self-watering planters from a Home Depot. I should have washed it before I did this video. I'm really not into cleaning, so it's gonna be, there's gonna be some messy stuff. But anyways, stop stroking the planter. There's some little forget-me-nots in here. There's some primroses and there's so many bulbs because I have a problem buying bulbs. I have so many bulbs. I didn't plant them. It's the middle of February. Who is making that noise? I might have a little bit of ADHD. Anyways, 
<laughs> I've been making these planters and videoing. Um, I'll make some videos of them. I've got some more over there. Um, primroses, it turns out, smell really good. Um, I thought I was just gonna make these videos and put these like violas on top, but the primroses are amazing. The new varieties they're coming out with. So anyways, I've been making these videos. There's bulbs inside here because I don't like making bulk containers and then just like having dirt on top. What the heck, why not put something pretty? So, okay, what am I gonna talk about on this channel? <laughs> so I'm gonna talk about making, I, I just, what I'm doing, right? What I'm doing in the greenhouse, I'm trying to like fill a landscape full of plants. I have a backyard that's pretty shady. I have a front yard that's pretty sunny, like mixed sun. Um, I'm plant planting the curb strip out front and that's full sun. Curb strips are challenging, so it'll be nice to video that and share my experiences with you. And I have a beach house. It's not right on the beach. It's like up on a bluff above the beach because we're in Washington State and it's really hilly and that's a thing. So um, I've been gardening there for about three years and there's some established things and there's some things that worked and didn't work and I've got a lot of stuff I wanna change. And so I might as well film some of that and share my reasoning with you, share what's working um, and not working. And even though both properties are different microclimates, they're both considered 8B. They're both considered the Maritime Northwest. And there aren't a lot of YouTube channels out there with information about planting in these areas. So even though being on camera is not my favorite thing to do. I'm here because I think this is important. I think learning how to garden is important. Um, I think you're important. I think you being able to access knowledge is important. And um, I care a lot about learning. So if you're in a similar climate, it's nice to have somebody else gardening um, in similar conditions. So you can just watch what they're doing and decide if you wanna try it too. And I'm going to show seeds, bulbs, plants, trees, waterfalls. I turned the waterfall off because it's noisy, but I'll show that to you. Um, it's nice to have a greenhouse. I'll show you me using the greenhouse, right? We'll do some talking in here. We'll do mostly planting because that's what I want to do. And um, hopefully I can share some of what I'm learning in my Master Gardener program and how other people in my community also garden in the Maritime Northwest. So thank you for joining me. If you decide to like and subscribe, I will see you in the next video. Bye.